Cool. All right. So best term in the world.com. I'm here with Mark St. Severe of the fucking insane Fang Island. We draw influences from everywhere, really. You know, yeah. we all like uh, different kinds of music. Uh, we've actually gotten the Queen. My mother actually said we reminded her of Queen, so which is kind of funny. Yeah, yeah. But uh, you know, like we love all the old shit, man. Queen, Thin Lizzy, stuff like that. I mean, Sam Yeah. Uh, obviously, you know. But uh, we just really just draw the influence from from everywhere. So is that on that on our record, uh, the self-titled is we recorded that over uh, the course of about a year. And it was all like it was all a very very kind of random and sporadic. Like Jason, you know, he'll write, you know, he'll have ideas and like get the skeleton of the song and we'll all kind of like chime in or like someone will have an idea. So I don't know. It's hard to answer. Like I, I guess I don't know if we we draw inspiration from one place in particular, but we do have those influences, but it's all very, I don't know if that makes sense to you. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> like, it's hard to explain. Well, it works, but so it's, it's just... I was always in bands, like, I was in, like, a Nirvana cover band with my friend across the street and my cousin when I was, like, 11. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. So, well, that's good. We were, we were trying. Yeah. We were yeah. trying anyways, so... Yeah. Yeah, I don't know, that was, that was my deal. I said it before, it might sound kind of lame, but it's, like, it's definitely, like, an energy exchange, too, you know what I mean? It's, like, yeah. it's fucking awesome to see someone, like just as pumped as you are, yeah. or maybe more, yeah, in, yeah. Some, in some weird way, because yeah. you know, people look so crazy uh, yeah. about, about what you're doing, you know, and, uh, yeah, of course, I mean, it's, so you, we do it for ourselves, we do it for everybody, we just want to have a good time, and, you know, yeah. and that's how it should be, you know, I agree, so, so you get off the road, we made that record, I, I literally joined the band like a week and a half before we started tracking drums, wow. so it was uh, kind of like uh, reflective of my personality, too, like, be a little, you know, socially socially retired in some ways. So it was like I was wasn't super comfortable with all the guys yet. And yeah. Like they're all, you know, they were like super nice, but it was like that weird comfort thing. But uh, now everything, you know, it's a lot more solid, and I just feel comfortable. And I think it's it's a little bit easier to throw things around for me with like other musicians when you have like that comfort level. Yeah. So it should be interesting to write the next record having having that, and you know, just wanting to make new music in general and just to see what comes out. You know. Cool. How long have you been playing drums for? Uh, about 12, 13 years. Okay. So. How'd you How'd you end up in drums? Uh, my dad. My dad's a drummer. Really? So uh, he had he actually had um, a John Bonham replica kit in one in, in some way it was uh, it was like the Steel Rat Ludwig. Oh yeah. Like 26 kick like all this stuff. I was like, I want to play that then. And then my friend across the street, you know, he, he was actually a drummer too, and then and a guitarist. So we just uh, we both loved Nirvana. Yeah. So, uh, so that's how the Nirvana. That, that's how that's how that started. And awesome. My kind of I don't want to sound too crazy, but my obsession with Dave Grohl. And uh, yeah, so you're gonna be my, my dad. Someone, he's a good one to be obsessed no, with. Yeah, oh man, you know, like so I guess I could say like my dad and Dave Grohl were like two guys that I was like really really want to play drums. You know, it's amazing. Yeah. Well, he's got a huge so. chrome Ludwig. So he used to have him. He traded him up. Ooh. He got something different. So all right, Dad. So when you're watching this Christmas. <laughs> See, that's what you're going to get. Thumbs down until Christmas, okay? <laughs> Take notes.